back to Simple and Delicious. My name is Jessica. I am starting the day off at Ace Hardware. I need to pick up some paint for a mirror that I'm redoing. My mom is helping me do it and we are missing the uh, mirror so we need to get it done. So I'm gonna run into Ace Hardware, pick up some spray paint. That is how I'm starting my day and then I'm actually heading to the office. So come along with me. I hope you guys enjoy these videos. Hope you're doing well. So, so many to choose from. Pretty color. I love that and this one as well. But I'm looking for either a cream or a white. So trying to hold the sun from hitting the camera. So I just went with white. I just went with the Rust-Oleum Painters Touch two times. Um, ultra cover paint and primer in one. So this is what it looks like. All right, let me see if my friend is waiting for me. Are you waiting for me? <laughs> let me zoom in. My hands are full, so. He's here. Hey, girl. <laughs> She's hilarious. I mean, seriously. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. How are you doing? We're going outside. Come in. Come on. You want a treat? Come on. That's a good girl. Come on. You want to treat? Still working. Still going strong. <laughs> Goldie, what do you think I have? Do you think I have something good up here? All I have is my drink. I don't have anything good. Promise. Mommy's the one eating, not me. <laughs> She's so funny. Okay, back to work. So I am home now. I just whipped up some dinner before we go to church. It is 5.30 and I'll show you what I made. I just quickly made some corn chowder. It looks really, really delicious. It's finished. So we're gonna go ahead and eat. And then I actually have some laundry I wanna fold before church and then we'll be heading to church here um, by seven. So this is the chowder. Um, it's a new recipe. So if I'm happy with it, I probably will share it with you guys. I think it turned out good. I did kind of beef it up a little bit because I felt like the spices weren't quite enough, but I kind of just made it my own. But yeah, it looks really, really delicious. I'm excited to try it. My way to church and oh my goodness, the sun is gorgeous. It is beautiful. I know I'm blinding you guys, but this is fall. This is fall. Excuse the bumpy roads, but if you live in warm climate, this is the beauty of fall. Just like the colors and the warmness of the colors. I don't know. It's just gorgeous. And they're pulling in the crops, as you can see. But yeah, it's just a beautiful evening. It's just a really, really beautiful evening. So by the way, the corn chowder was delicious. And I think I will definitely share that recipe with you guys. I posted it on my Instagram. Um, but one thing I really liked about it was it was so simple. And literally, I could have gotten it done in 30 minutes. It maybe took a little bit longer just because I let it cook a little bit longer. Um, but yeah, I probably could have had it from prep to table in a half an hour, which is awesome. Well, 
I am headed to church now. Um, our church starts at seven. I do have a couple errands I need to run, or maybe just one. I know I need to get Epsom salt and I need to get parchment paper. So whether I go to Walmart or Kroger, I don't know. But I bought some meat in bulk. If you haven't watched it yet, I just um, uploaded a Aldi's Instacart grocery haul and I bought some be meat, beef. Yes, I bought beef. I bought meat in bulk. So I need to portion that out and get it in the freezer. And what I do is I use parchment paper to do that and that keeps it from sticking. Um, it just works really well. I wrap it in parchment paper first and then I put it in Ziploc bags or freezer bags. Um, so yeah, that's something I need to do tonight or tomorrow. Oh, regardless if I want to or not, I need to do it. So I am out of parchment paper. So I definitely need to pick some up. So that's on the agenda for after church. So yeah, I don't know, we'll see what else life brings us. I know for sure that I need to, I need to fold laundry. Did not do that, but yeah. I originally thought that I wasn't going to make dinner because my husband was gonna work till church, but he came home, so I made dinner. So I didn't do much of anything else, but anyways, yeah. So that's what's going on. I will check in with you after church. So I just got out of church and I have about a half an hour, actually I have 40 minutes um, until TJ Maxx closes. So I am going there because I buy the Jason body wash and I'm almost out. So I thought I would just go here, get Epsom salt and my body wash. And then I don't know if I'll get parchment paper tonight or if I'll just get it in the morning. So yeah, TJ Maxx it is. I love shopping at TJ Maxx at night. It's only 10 till nine, I got 40 minutes. I can shop forever. We do still have some fall stuff. And there is a lot of really cute things left, so they're probably replenishing it. So I just got home from church and from TJ Maxx and I thought I would give you a small haul. I'm gonna actually stick you up in here. <sighs> the lighting's bad because it's nighttime, but that's okay. So what I actually went for, one of the things that didn't have exactly what I wanted, but this will work. I love the Jason, I assume that's how you say it. This will not work. Look what I got. I got the hand soap. That stinks. I wanted the body wash. I don't know why I grabbed this. I thought it was the same thing because it's in the same type of bottle, but the bottle I usually get is much bigger, so I thought, oh, it's just a smaller one. It's the hand soap. That's okay, I'll use it in my bathroom. Okay, the other thing I went for was Epsom salt. So this is called Eep, Epsoak, or EP Soak, or Epsoak. Every day, this is the sleep formula, so it has lavender essential oil. It's all natural. Yeah, so let me give it a smell. I'll let you guys know how it is. So this bag was $5.99, which is a pretty good price. It's a pretty large bag. And the bag was two pounds. Oh yeah, that's really nice. And it's very true to the lavender smell as well. It doesn't smell fake. So that is good. So I got this for my bath. My phone charger broke yesterday. I have one for my car, one for the house. It broke, so I picked up another one. This one was $8.99. The brand is First, first Class. Um, so hopefully, this works well for the house. Yeah, like the whole entire, this part got stuck in my phone, which is interesting, and broke. So, whatever. Get a new one. Yes, perfect. Not too long. Actually, I probably should switch this one out for my car because then 
it, the one I have in my car is really, really long. So these are the journals that I got. They were three for $2.99. These would be super cute gifts, like even stocking stuffers, like office gifts, um, anything like that, or teacher gifts, church gifts. Um, but they each have a different scripture on them, which I love. And it's really nice because they are lined inside. So what I will do is like put the month and the year and then the notes that pertain to that month. So that's how I organize it. But on the back, there's also flowers as well. I think I will start with, be still and know that I am God. I'm gonna start with that one. So that is everything that I got at TJ Maxx. So that is going to be today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this day in the life. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe. Stay tuned for more Vlogtober videos. I am enjoying sharing with you guys very much and I hope you're enjoying it as well. So thank you so much for watching friends and I look forward to talking to you soon. Bye. You've been a good friend. And that's in the thick and thin.